Quitch is a gamified educational platform founded by two university professors that capitalised on the distractions that currently hinder students' learning, such as mobile phones. This presentation provides recommendations based on analysis with regards to the branding of the app. Whilst Quitch also operates within primary and secondary education sectors as well as the corporate sector, the main focus of this branding strategy relates to Quitch's involvement within the higher education sector, as this is their main target market. This higher education target market consists of three tiers that are all interrelated, and these are outlined. The first of these is the higher education institutions and heads of faculties. This first tier consists of those who make the decision to purchase the licensing fee for the app and use it within the institution. Secondly are the lecturers and tutors. Once the licensing fee has been purchased, the institutions rely on lecturers and tutors to adopt the new app and promote it to students. And finally, the students themselves, who are the main users of the app. All three tiers of the target market share a common characteristic. They are all searching for a new and innovative way to learn and educate. The three tiers are ordered by importance, as successfully reaching the first tier has a follow-on effect to the second and third tiers. However, student satisfaction with the app remains one of the most important goals. It remains imperative for Quitch to leverage their points of parity amongst their competitors as well as have compelling points of difference, which is one key aspect that this branding strategy addresses. Two key competitors have been identified through background research. StudyBlue describes itself as the largest crowdsourced study library and its users have access to over 400 million flashcards, notes and study guides from other students. The second of these is Quizlet, who claims to be the world's largest student and teacher online learning community. It boasts 50 million active learners from 130 countries and it provides its users with over 300 million study sets. The positioning of the app. The positioning of Quitch will be determined by the frame of reference and the market that Quitch competes within and its competitors. As stated previously in the presentation, Quitch's main competitors are currently Quizlet and Study Blue. Identified points of parity between these brands are all three competitors alike are compatible with desktops, smartphones and tablets, which is a requirement to compete within the app industry. Whereas the points of difference between Quitch and competitors are the elements that position Quitch as being a convenient, a supportive and trusted app that promotes self-directed learning through the use of push notifications and reminders. Unlike competitors, the branding and the positioning of Quitch will demonstrate that the app not only supports learning while actively using the app, but encourages extra interaction and moments of study throughout the day prompted by these notifications. In addition to this, Quitch enables both flipped and blended learning options and as a result should be positioned towards tertiary educators in order to enrich learning environments for both teachers and students in the tertiary setting. Additionally, the app will be positioned based on other benefits such as engagement loops, points and badge systems and progression trees. Furthermore, through strategic marketing strategies, Quitch will establish distinctiveness of the brand through online community forums and social media to highlight the brand's focus on collaboration and self-directed learning. Brand elements are trademarkable devices that serve to identify and differentiate the brand. They are important as they contribute to increasing awareness and boosting recall and recognition. Quitch is a strong brand name, although it is another term for couch grass. It is likely the name was chosen because it's distinct and easy to pronounce and remember. The name translates to score in Portuguese and grass in Spanish, which is something to be mindful of if choosing to expand to these countries. The name could possibly stand for a combination of quizzes and technology, which is something that should be showcased if this is true. Moving on to logo, Quitch's current logo isn't very impactful and memorable. The main colour is red, and often, which is often associated with hunger and passion, which doesn't really fit with the core values of the brand or product. 
Orange is associated more with creativity, enthusiasm and thinking, which more seems to fit with improving the student's education, which is what the app is about. The smooth flowing cue in the logo isn't very impactful or represent what the product does. Due to this, it is recommended that Quitch change their logo. On this slide is some examples of how the logo could be changed, showcasing it in both red and in orange. Brand experiences. Quitch will focus on effective and intellectual dimensions of brand experience, alongside key touch points, marketing communication and product. Effective dimensions will appeal largely to the inner feelings and emotions of the target market. Quitch will associate itself with the story of a hero and foe, with the hero rising against a relentless enemy, time and competing demands on attention. Outlining product performance outcomes will invoke intellectual dimensions of brand experience, encouraging thought about the potential benefits and future learning outcomes of Quitch. Marketing communication. Quitch will use social media platforms to disseminate effective dimensions of the brand experience directly to target segments using web traffic data and geo-targeting. Direct mail will allow Quitch to target decision makers directly in a customised way, circulating both the think and feel dimensions of the experience. The product design will surpass expectations of the user through key points of difference and meeting functional needs during both purchase and Secondary sources of brand equity. Key secondary sources for Quitch comprise Brand Alliance and third-party sources including reviews and testimonials. When developing a Brand Alliance, it's important to consider fit based on variables such as values, characteristics and positioning. Gamification in education is an innovative and emerging area. A brand alliance with a foreign market university that has a reputation for focusing on innovation and cutting-edge technology would align with Quitch. A well-matched alliance can lead to more positive consumer evaluations in both domestic and foreign markets. With the transparency and accessibility provided by search engines, websites and social media, user reviews and testimonials have increasing impact on buyer decision making and brand equity. With consumers increasingly turning to online reviews to evaluate brands and products, it is recommended that Quitch actively engage and invite followers and customers to complete online reviews and testimonials, adding credibility to communication strategies and encouraging active brand engagement.